friends welcome back and today i want to show you about four ways autocad can show you the area of any geometric shape number first is to use the properties command or function suppose if you have a geometry like this one and you want to determine its area so how can you do that well you will have to just make the geometry is a boundary geometry by using of course the boundary command or function you can say and then select and right click on the object and then just click the properties tab so the properties dialog box will appear where you can of course see the area and parameter of the same object or geometry number second is to use the list command or function in order to use this function just type list in the command bar and press enter or space from your keyboard now specify the boundary or region object and press enter so the list of the same object will appear with different types of permissions which also includes of course the area and perimeter of the same object number third is to use the mass properties function in order to use this functionality of cad we will type reg in the command bar and press enter then we will select or specify the object that we want to be converted into 2d solid now again we will type mass prop this means of course the mass properties in the command bar and then we will specify the same object so the dialog box will appear with much informations including the area and parameter of the geometry number four and the last method is to use the area command friends to use this function just type double a and the command bar and press enter to load the functionality now specify or click all the corners of the geometry once you close the traverse just press the enter key from your keyboard so the area is shown in the command bar remember you can copy and paste it where you want by control plus c and control plus v also remember if your geometry contains round edges then you can use the object function and the area command for example, what if I need to work out the area of the given shape? So how can I do that? Well, we will have to make this object as a boundary object by using the boundary function of CAD. And then we will type double A in the command bar and press enter and then O per object and press enter. Now we will select the geometry to find its area remember you will see the area of the same object in the command bar and they are set so these are about four ways autocad can show you the area of an object hey if you like this video please hit that subscribe button press the bell icon and never miss in other update from an engineer boy thank you dears for watching see you next time and wassalam